Hello class, I thought I would make a PowerPoint, um, actually a, a screencast-o-matic about how to hand in the crosswords. Um, some of you guys are having a little bit of trouble doing it, um, and that's understandable. It's a little different in um, Canvas than it is Blackboard. My other Blackboard classes right now um, aren't having the problems that you guys are, so it's not your fault, and I just want to kind of help you guys figure out how to do this. So obviously, um, I'm in student view right now. Um, you go and click on, you get to the crossword section itself, the assignment section itself, um, and then you download, you click this and download the, the doc file. Um, if you're having problems with Mac kind of stuff, uh, I'm going to give you an option um, in a second. Um, or you can go to the library, That's the, just use a PC there. Uh, but you download that, which I've already done, um, so I'm not going to do it again, uh, but that's that's very, very easy to do. Um, and it will, you know, it'll look like that. Um, I'm actually going to close out of that one because it's one that uh, that I don't have set up. So I've I've put in some uh, fake words here, um, you know, lasted falls and dolphin, um, <laughs> which you know are not part of our vocabulary. Um, so when you've done that, what you should do is click on this little um, uh, arrow icon, this little target icon, and it'll it'll let you select the whole entirety of the table because this is really just a table. Uh, and then you come back here and you go to submit assignment and um, what you're going to do when you go to submit assignment is click text entry um, and you can um, you can paste this in um, and it might look crazy in, on your side but it'll come out alright on mine this is just the cells of the table it's showing you um, it actually will come out okay on my side so don't worry about that and I think that's kind of screwing up some of you guys um, but if you don't want to do that, you know what, for this one you can just choose a file and attach it. You know, you can save your uh, your document here um, and um, then go ahead and uh, and um, attach it. So I'll, I'll do this one, uh, let's see, I'll save this on my uh, desktop and we'll save that there. And once it's saved, you could also save it as a PDF if you wanted to, it doesn't matter. Um, and then come over here and go to choose file uh, and then go there and open that up uh, and then put submit assignment and you're good to go okay so it's just that easy um, I'm giving you guys some options um, for how to turn it in with the crosswords but just know that it might look crazy on your end but it'll come out alright those those grid lines won't be uh, when I see it so I won't have a problem with that at all all right, have fun with it, though. It's intended to be a fun assignment, and it's good to build up vocabulary. It's kind of a lost art in our classes. Now everybody's trying to have you guys write for high-level critical thinking, but I really think that you guys learning terms and vocabulary is a great thing to do as well still. Okay, and good luck with the module, and uh, keep uh, keep up the good work.